Um, you made some great saves in the beginning of the game, and then at the end of the game, they didn't quite go your way. And just to comment a little bit on that. Um, well, the first, uh, we knew they were great at corners, so we are trying to uh, not let them get any corners, but of course they're going to get a few, and um, that drag flick was a great shot. Um, I saw it, I was there, it just, sometimes it just don't get behind it, so um, it was unfortunate, but it was a great shot by them. And uh, the second one, she, uh, I dropped a little too early and she sculled around me and put it in the back of the net, so she did what she needed to do, and I just didn't do what I needed to do, so you give them two seconds and they come right through the defense. You can't let down for any time at this level. It's just, they, um, they came at us real good second half. And as a starting keeper uh, for the U.S. and as your first World Cup, what have you learned in the World Cup this far? You can't let up, ever. One second you let up, the ball can come through. It, it happens so quick at this level that you always have to be on your guard. You have to make sure everybody's covered in the back especially with all the lifts they can do. It's not always just hit through, they can lift it over you, so you have to make sure everyone's covered. And you gotta stay on the defense the entire 70 minutes of the game. Okay, thank you.